how's it going? I'm Aaron Hallett. All right, original Christian rock. I decided to do something different today. Um, musically, that is. Video, pretty much the same format. I write songs. I show you how I write songs, which is just improvising and coming up with stuff and putting it together. The whole idea is basically don't overthink songwriting, just start doing it. I just made a really long loop and I'm not talking about the usual drum loop I do. I normally do have a drum loop that I use as a metronome, but then I replace that with a drum part that I'm going to play. But I actually just made some synth like stuff on like some arpeggiators. Super easy. I just did a B minor to, or no, a D to a B minor, like D major seven or something. What I do, or no, add six, I think. I don't know. Something like that. It's some, some sort of D major chord into a B minor chord. It's just those two chords over and over again. And it's on an arpeggiator. So it's kind of just going all over the chord notes. That's just going to be like an underneath texture. And then I'm going to build the song on top of it. That's what I'm thinking for today. Usually my song structure is A, B, A, B, A, B. That easy and subject to change per song. I'm probably gonna do that, so I'll do like a thing where I just do simply D major to B minor for a verse, and then the chorus, I'll do some other stuff, but that loop should work over top, just kinda like as a lead line or something, so. Mm. That'll probably be the verse. Chorus. I'm going to build off that, so I'm going to just start recording. Left and right guitar happening now. I'm gonna do a lead part. I think I'm just gonna do it in the chorus. I'll probably just do like a really simple tapping thing, like probably only the chorus. I say that because sometimes I get bored and just start playing stuff. Um, little advice too, if you ever screw up something and you're recording and you're just making it up, as long as it's in key, just keep it and keep repeating the same mistake. Sounds on purpose. But I did that second chorus coming in. I totally forgot I was going into the second chorus, started playing the verse. And then I was like, all right, so I'm just going to do D and slide up. So I kept doing that and I think it sounds good. It'll be like an interesting texture once, you know, song progresses. Uh, here I go. I'll probably do this. I may or may not harm it. He's on the other side. If not, I'll just do something else completely different, but I have no idea. So let's just hit record and see what happens. I'm going to improvise a guitar solo on the third verse, so here we go. Okay, it took me a couple tries to get that solo. I was like, everything sounds flat. It didn't occur to me to check the tuning. It was literally flat, so I tuned up, then played. Worked out well, so I think solo came out good. Um, bass guitar, improvising a lot too here. I'm going to keep like a simple groove though, because this is definitely groove oriented, so... drums are up next so the loop is gone a drum loop not the other loops metronome's up kit's on i should be good so i'm just gonna sit down and start playing a part after the drums i actually did two things no one thing but what kind of two i did a thing in the chorus so i just added more layers to the like loop thing so it just has an extra third layer of the same chords over top just to make it a little bit more prominent once the chorus kicks in and then i came up with some lyrics did a little bit of warm-up singing 
muted it so it's not interfering, but it's there for reference. Yeah, so I'm just gonna try and uh, get through this thing. Here I go. Oh, it's got my like gym bag on. <laughs> I like went in the house, get rid of the coffee cup and stuff. Uh, and that was on me because before I started this, I was in the gym doing squats. It was leg day. So yeah. Okay, I think I'm gonna do harmony on the chorus. That's it. I think the vocals came out good. The lyrics are going to be in the description box. They're in the bottom. I have where you can purchase and stream my music in the middle of the description box. So if you go look at it, you're going to see like a link. That'll be like a YouTube topic page if you use YouTube music. And then I also have other stuff, iTunes and Amazon, Spotify, and that sort of thing and a big list. If you use any one of those services, there's no links there, but if you use it, just go to it. Type my name in the search bar and you should find me. Type the same name as the YouTube channel, Aaron Hallett. And the very top link I have is PastorMelissaScott.com. I just have that there because I said this is Christian rock right in the beginning. And that is the best Bible teaching I know of. And I put that there because it's the best Bible teaching I know of. So unlike everybody else that I see anyway, online especially, this place is actually just teaching the Bible as it's written. They go to the trouble of translating from original languages, so Hebrew, Aramaic, Greek. They do so just to get the exact meaning the writers were intending. And it's all about faith, building that relationship with God, realizing that all fall short there's no great, good, better person. We all fall short. We're all on the same footing. You just come to God as you are. God works it out because Jesus paid the price for everybody. That's the idea. God came down as Jesus in the flesh. Yeah, can't talk. <laughs> Played the part as the kinman, kinsman redeemer. And because he did that, he bought up the whole field. So every single person that ever existed, but he's looking for one characteristic. That characteristic is faith. The only way you can please God as the Bible says, is faith. You're not getting anywhere by doing good things, doing all these whatever you're doing. You just trust God implicitly and act in faith. And they do a lot of teaching on that. Anyway, the teaching is fantastic. I can't say enough good stuff about it. Just check it out. That's, you know, why I put it there. So if you want to see my music or hear my music, that is, subscribe, like, comment, share. You'll keep seeing me. Check out my playlists. I got a whole bunch of music. I have literally hundreds of original songs. And if you go check out, say, my Spotify, Amazon, whatever, hundreds of songs. So you can just stream for hours. I write a lot of music. <laughs> This is, uh, yeah, this is done. So you're going to see multiple windows, same screen. I'm going to go take a nap. Um, enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Bye.
Oh, uh-huh.